It's an exciting unboxing for me today because this is going to be my first, uh, our first Shibuya Scramble figure, E-Stream, figure, figure. Um, this is Demon Rem, Crystal Dress version. Uh, I mean, I saw the original Rem, the Crystal Dress, the non-Demon version, but I, I think this one looks a lot better. I really like the, the Demon version look, that, minute, that really uh, sinister look in her eyes is, and the weapon is pretty cool. And I knew this thing was big from the original Crystal Dress, and the pictures of, and reviews of that, but I did not realize how big the actual box is. Just check out how big it is compared to Susie. This thing is so big, the box is so hard wow. to make sure that the, the camera can capture everything. There's a little instruction. Oh, let me oh. on the screen there. It's on the website. There's English. Yeah, huh. blah, blah, blah. Oh, so there's a, a website on how to assemble this. So, so he's going to take a look. Okay, so Susie actually checked out the site that was on the sheet. And actually the instructions are pretty detailed, except it's only in Japanese. So uh, use Google Translate. So let's see if we can get this damn thing out, out of here. All right, I need Susie's help here. Wow. She's big. I didn't expect the weapon to be that size. Wow. Wow, it's gonna take up a lot of display area. But that's one seventh scale only. Why is well, the weapon I guess, so big? I know, right? I'm curious to see how big she is. Okay, so first up. Uh, Huge morning star. This is one seventh scale. That's that's massive. I put my hand <laughs> finger beside it. That's huge. I don't remember in the anime her her morning star being this big. Anyways, let me. Oh, actually, uh, I'll take out the main body first. I'll take her this piece out later. This piece is taped on. It's just taped on here. Okay. Oh, I gotta be careful when I cut here then. Oh, it's two, oh, both two effect parts of the effects. Okay. This looks interesting. What the hell am I doing? <laughs> I guess you just take her I think that's a whole piece, right? It's a complete piece. You're right. That piece was the bottom. Yeah. But then... So do you want to you want put that on and then, then flip, flip it? her? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> but either way, I shouldn't be able to get her out. I don't understand why it's so I difficult. Know, it's probably... I don't this, know. This, right? Will that be easier that way? Yeah. Yeah, the things are... Okay. Oh, All right, that's better. There we go. Okay, you can, yeah, now you then, can take off the front. Oh, no, matter. the she front won't is... come off. What? So is that why... Get... I think there's is nothing. Is that why that's talking about... Oh, here. There's a nub here. Right? No, but the, the nub is, like, inside. No, no. Oh. No, that's, that's the thing. That's the effect part. Oh, okay. I have no is that what the... Out. But I couldn't... Who's gonna double check the uh, the instructions there? Four corners of the figure are fixed with irregularities. If you remove the unevenness at the four corners, the front and back blister will come off. <laughs> That's really an encrypted message. So I think we should maybe flip it back again because we can't do anything on this side anyways because it doesn't come out. Oh, so I think okay. remove the back flip and then the figure out back and what's then going on. Yeah. Right. I, well, I think we need to unfasten this, these ones, right? Yeah, so I guess actually maybe this is easier because you can see th these fasteners. Yeah, I think so. Now, is it tape? Oh, this is so dangerous. There's pieces everywhere. Look at that. Yeah, you gotta be careful. Can they see? Like there's... I, I'll, I'll hold I it know. up. I think it's pretty safe. There's... Where my thumb is here, there's like plastic pieces that hold the figure in place to the front blister where my thumb is. And if you look at my other hand, this hand, this side has another one here inside. So you got to kind of pry open these while trying not to break anything on her. So well, this at least piece, it's good. It's a separate off. Okay. piece. And it's not taped down. Thank oh. God. Um, okay, so that there is? must be another one here uh, connected yeah. somehow. I guess it's similar structure. So 
so this plastic piece underneath there's some clear there's some clear effect parts but there's also a clear effect part above this thing we're supposed to pop off okay so we moved the table up a bit to get a better view of this thing and uh i think Susie's figured it out so the annoying thing is I, I can't really show it on camera because all this clear stuff so basically you have this clear thing that's holding the figure in place that we need to remove to get the figure out but then under it under this thing there's some effect parts and then on top of it there's an effect part so now i gotta get it out but not too high or also break the top effect part so susie with her nimble fingers is able to get the other nub off finally and now i can very carefully slide the damn thing out yeah so it looks like this look at that piece this like it has to slide out so one piece was <gasps> under and one piece was above it's madness she is small now what? Yeah. Remove all this stuff. And then install <laughs> the, the two, the three things, actually. Uh, okay, so I think I got everything else off except for... The Why do they suddenly paper. use paper? I guess they're afraid of paint transfer, maybe? Wow. Or oil transfer? So it's like, it's squeezed in there quite tightly, you just... Oh. Kind of have to use a little, but it rips it here. Rip, yeah. Okay, the main thing is done. Let's see if you can get a better shot of that. Okay, now the bits. The bits don't look fun to attach on. Okay, so the first effect part is this thing. There's a so this actually just goes on the front. Uh, let me rotate her a little bit. Oh, um, I don't know if you can see in the, see if I can get it to focus on there. Yeah. So this part goes in, but it, it's kind of rough and doesn't look very stable. We'll it's a pretty that. big peg. It's a pretty big peg, but it's not very smooth. I think because it's those clear material, oh. plastic. It goes in pretty easily. I'm not gonna really go hard into it because if you need to pop it back out, which I probably do, um, it's gonna be hell. So it's this piece this time. And again, the connection pegs. Let me see if I can get it in focus. Uh, there we go. This time it's two, but also the still that clear plasticky stuff. Kind of rough and, and stuff doesn't, doesn't feel very stable. So where does it go? Align the concave shape of the base with the convex shape of the effect and insert it. Thanks? <laughs> what does that mean? No, I know what that it means. That means you but plug it into the hole. Yeah, but where's the but hole? That's where she's pointing. Oh, is it on the side? Oh, I know, I know, yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. I inside it, right? A, yeah, yeah, you're gonna go inside somewhere. Just okay, so let in. me show. So here's the, here's the morning star. There it is, that's is it focused. Heavy? It's no, it's all plastic. Oh, okay. Even the chain is plastic, which is what I worry about. Is it bendy? No. Oh. It, it's only bendy what? because it's long. <laughs> There's a hole right oh, there. Here. here, is that a peg? Oh, okay, there it is. Yeah. So I'll move that away, so. There's a peg right there, where my finger is. That's where this goes, I guess. Then look how bent. The, the picture shows it bends out but looking at the chain that it comes with it bends back so let me put this on first yeah that's what i said right. it's probably better to put that on first perfect yay thank you Susie. that was great oh this is, uh, i mean it don't get me wrong this thing looks impressive as hell Given this, it's like she's massive. She is about, she is about one seven scale. So I'll give them yeah. that. So, but that morning star still, I don't remember her as being that big. Now I have to go back to the anime and see if that's true. <laughs> but yeah, so there it is. I actually, it wasn't that complicated an unboxing. It was just slow and dangerous, really, with all these clear effect parts.